Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Grand Theft Auto 5 Glitches. In uh, this video, I think I'll have maybe one, two, maybe even three glitches to share for you guys. Um, I don't know how many that is yet, it's all depending on what I do with editing. But for this first get glitch that I'm going to show you guys, um, it is how to reduce your wanted level if you're going into a store and robbing it. So let's say you get a gun out, <clears throat> go into the store, start okay, okay, robbing it. And you're trying to get the uh, guy to give you some cash. You wait for him to give you some cash here. Once he uh, ends up doing that. And right, then once he gives you the money, you got all the money. You get back in your car. Once you get into your car, you can pull up your interaction menu. Start driving. And then you go over to style, accessories. And equip a mask when you equip a mask look my wants level went down to one star this will make it a lot easier for you guys to get away from the cops instead of having to get two star cops that are already looking after you so it's a lot easier this way now that you have a mask equipped on my wanted level was at two stars now it's at one so this is a very useful quick glitch that you can do whenever you're robbing a bank just to get that quick cash and make an easy getaway to get away from the cops. And look, I'm already away from the cops. That's how easy it was, isn't it? I feel like it even take uh, took some of the time away to even to get away from the cops here. So very useful glitch. Um, show you guys a few new glitches here in a sec. All right, guys, for this glitch, you're going to want to go to where I am right now on the map. This is the fire station right next to the Eclipse Towers. I'll show you guys the map right here. There's the Eclipse Towers, and this is where I am. So right down the street from the Eclipse Towers, you're going to want to go right here. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to find a truck like this. You can find any of these trucks laying around anywhere in the GTA, GTA 5 map. They're pretty common. Just find a truck that is very tall, like a mule truck will work too, like one of the smaller versions, as long as they still are pretty tall. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to park it next to that garage thing, just like how I have it here. You're going to you're gonna want to climb up onto it, and then you're going to want to literally just climb up into the top of the garage. And now you're glitched into the map. However, this is a very dangerous spot because it's a very, very hard to get anywhere else after this point because there's a ledge right here and I mess up on purpose just to show you guys how careful you guys actually have to be in order to do this glitch right. Uh, so it is very, very, um, a very, very tiny ledge there that you have to be very careful on. I'll show you guys right here. I'll do the jumping through the, uh, the top of the thing here again, but what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to follow me exactly how I do it right here. So you want to go just like how I am, otherwise you are going to fall off. Right here, it's okay to fall down now. So now you're right next to the um, firefighters. You can see the uh, car there. Once you get over here, these red bricks that you see me walking up to, they are all solid, so you can walk around anywhere you want on these red bricks right here. And as well, you can shoot outside of this area. So anywhere outside of this area over here, you can literally just shoot anybody, anything you want. I'll uh, put an RPG out there. I'll shoot a car just to show you. There you go. You can just do pretty much anything you want here. Just keep blowing everything up. You can shoot out of it. Unfortunately, you can't shoot through anything solid, which makes sense. Or actually, like the garage doors that are right in front of me right here. You can't shoot in between them, and you can't shoot through them. But you can shoot on this side over here as well. So this is a very good location. If you are getting attacked by a lot of people, you will be completely invincible here. Nobody can do anything to you, and is a very accessible area with a lot of view range, so you can mess with a lot of people like this, and it will really help you guys out. 
So, right here I just show you guys that I'm getting a few cops on me just to show you that they cannot shoot through. They cannot find you either. So, if you try to get them to shoot you, they're not even going to be able to shoot you. Plus, they won't be able to find you. They did shoot me a little bit here just to show you that there's no way they could damage you. But... You can literally just farm the police as much as you want, and you can just shoot them as much as you want. They literally just cannot shoot through. Right here, the uh, policeman that's right next to me, he gets up and starts trying to shoot me, but he can't shoot. See, he's trying to shoot me right there, and he can't shoot through. So, nobody can shoot through. Nobody can, like, RPG through here. You are completely invincible in this spot, and... It is a very good invincibility glitch if you're wanting to uh, troll your friends or um, make fun of your friends or anything. Say that they can never kill you and basically have god mode. Alright, for this next glitch, you are actually going to want to stay in this position. This one kind of goes along with this glitch. What you're going to want to do is you're going to walk off this, the red bricks here and quickly deploy your parachute. And you're going to want to fly over to the next lot over just how I'm doing if you see on the minimap I'm flying right over to this next lot over here and then you're just going to want to slowly just fall down in your uh, parachute right around this lot here so you just want to go in circles around this lot until you get down far enough and what you're going to see in a second here is a secret apartment this apartment has been in here for a long time there it is you cannot go inside of it but you can get on top of it and is a really cool area once you get once you fall beneath the apartment you're instantly back up to the top of the map so you're right at the bottom of the map here i have no idea why they put it up here but it's a very cool apartment if you guys do this glitch you can easily see this apartment and see something that rockstar kind of wanted to put in there but never really put in there so just like that i'm on top of the uh, map again because i was so far down and there's the three glitches Alright guys, hope you guys liked the video. Make sure to comment, like, subscribe if you guys want more. And comment down below if you guys want a certain glitch that you guys want to see up here. Um, if I do not know it, I will try my best to find that out for you guys as soon as I can. Given the uh, time I have available in real life to do that. And that's pretty much it from there. So if you want a glitch to see up here on one of these videos if you are trying to figure out something and you don't know how to do it let me know i will try my best to figure that out for you guys and i will see you guys in the next video eyes in the sky gazing far into the night i raise my hand to the fire but it's no use cause you can't stop it from shining through